think to start with, we'll take it alternative moves. So maybe we're pl we're playing one of our accounts. Maybe we're playing my account. Yeah, and we we'll sure. just take it turns. We we'll play on rated, but if you want to play us, you have to be logged into chess.com, obviously, because that's where we're playing. So make sure you're on chess.com. You have to tell us your um, basically username on chess.com in the chat. If you're a subscriber to this channel, then I will give you a uh, you know you get a better chance of playing us some benefits. By the way, we just had a, a big cheer there of thank you very much nicholas stosin uh who just gave us a hundred a thousand a thousand cheers I don't, I don't know what that is but that might go towards the dwarves uh bjorn <laughs> okay <laughs> now i didn't that, get the first part of the stream but i guess you announced the dwarves <laughs> I, I i haven't mentioned the dwarves at all oh okay <laughs> <laughs> so no one knows what i'm talking about at all that makes absolutely no sense that makes okay. absolutely no sense but it okay. might make some sense to you it, yes it does it does okay <laughs> good so i'm glad i'm glad that's <laughs> that's all rectified um so yeah so we're gonna have a jabava stream anyway so so first of all um well i'll tell you i'll tell you what we do shall i before we while people in the chat get a bit warmed up and get on chess.com shall i just play a game and we'll take it in turns on my account this is gonna yep. be dangerous so we, we might even play let's see if we can take down a gm shall we be on so you're oh, gonna man. have to tell me the alternative moves can you see my yeah. board? Can you see my board? You might have to follow it, or do you want me to, do you want me to share yeah. it? No, no, I can I can follow it on just on Karma. I, I think that's the easier one. Okay. If I just follow you when you start the game. Okay, all right. So uh, I, I'm searching for a game now. So hopefully, hopefully we have the white pieces. It'll, if we have black, we'll do alternative moves anyway, shall we? And, okay, yeah, and, yeah, sure. we'll do that. And I expect we're okay. We got white. Yeah, we're playing uh -huh. a twenty-five sixty. Okay, let me bring up the board. Okay, so the board is up. Okay, and yeah. If we, if we get too short time, I'll take over. But you, you go first. So D four. <laughs> okay, good stuff. So oh, we're gonna play the Jabarva London in every game, and maybe we'll have a look at each game afterwards. And yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna go Knight C three. This is the Jabarva London. And Bishop F four. Okay, good. This is the start of the Jabarva London, and uh, like I say, this is okay. All good your move oh yeah sorry <laughs> <laughs> oh okay hmm so we're gonna test Bjorn's knowledge I might give clues yeah uh, I might give clues I'm gonna go g4 yay <laughs> let's this, do it <laughs> this is the this is the move I recommend in the course above and uh, in actual fact, it's the move. Oh, I, I see you. I, I don't follow your Twitch. I'm uh, following uh, the um, the board on chess.com, so I'm not seeing the suggestions. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, but... this is the move. Magnus Carlsen actually played this against Fabiano Caruana. Okay. So, uh, your move now. I'm afraid. Yeah, we go G5, I think. Yeah, you sure? No. No, I'm not. Uh... No, we, we're going to go knight uh, f3. Okay. Now, someone's saying maybe we should play a bit of a longer time limit, <laughs> as this could get quite frantic. But, okay. Oh, that's true. All right. So if see. it's... Yeah, you move. Okay. I'm just going to try to shove Gary up the board here. Yeah, yeah. Clearly. So, you know, this is the way we're going to go. This is quite an interesting position. This this is one interesting way to play as white in the Jabava London and maybe like I say maybe we have a quick look at the games afterwards that we play as well so remember if you do want to play us let us know your chess.com handle and twitch and please be ready to play oh uh, let's see what here, is he yeah. doing he wants to put his knight on e4 yeah I'm gonna play a3 just to stop that okay does that stop it uh, I thought so, yeah. Maybe not. That stops knight e4, does it? Okay. I've got to work out how it stops it. Right. Am I going b4? Is that your idea? Well, he goes knight takes knight there. Worse than takes that. So I can't do that. Okay. Hmm. Shite. <laughs> um... Yeah, I'm not sure. Okay. About, I'm not sure about this one. Uh, no, me neither. Okay, right. Now, uh, I think the I think A3 didn't actually stop his idea there. 
No. Uh, knight d5. Knight d5. E5. Knight e5. I think. I, I, okay. I think it is my move, but I, a knight e5. Oh, it, it is your move. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm struggling. Yeah. Okay. I'll take this one. Okay. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to fight back. I think what we should do when we're playing people in the chat. I think we should go for five minute at least. Yeah. Five. Exactly. Yeah. So this this is a good this is a good test. It takes. We're... Okay. Sorry. I was a bit. I jumped the gun there. <laughs> so. Yeah. That's all right. Okay. That's not really much to do. I will change uh, my settings in a minute. You just have to tell me your, all you have to do is tell me your chess.com name in the settings. You don't have to do anything else at all. This is not that bad. This is still, we're still, a, we're still sort of alive, I, I say. Okay, should I make the moves, Bjorn, as we're running out of time? <laughs> yeah. I think we've learned that we need more time. Yes. <laughs> it's been a value. Oh, there's a, what about night? Yeah, it's pinned. Oh, not take C4? It's oh, pinned. It's, and now? Now it's not pinned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, now, now we might better do it. But now... Oh, did you trap the bishop now? Uh, no, I think it was as if... No, we... yeah, yeah, you can get so out. We're, yeah. we're, still, we're, still, we're still in with a shout. Be nice to start with a win. Uh, we've got knight takes... Knight takes here is a bit annoying. I don't know what he does against this. And his queen is, you know, a little bit funny. So... Do you want to uh, pre-move, Bjorn? What, what are you going to pre-move? Well, uh, knight takes e4. Okay. Oh, yeah. No, not now. Now you take. Yeah, take I on play. d3. Yeah, okay. no Have time. to and then bishop f. Yeah. Okay. But now. Now we've got g5 on knight here. Let's get the knight there and get him going. Yeah. Okay, we've got, to we've got to checkmate him. This is like our... Uh, uh, okay. And then g5. Yeah, come on. We've got 22 seconds to... to... That's so bad now. It's not. It's not a bad position, but we can take the deep on even. It, it's pretty bad on time. He's getting a bit low as well. Okay, rook takes maybe. Rook Look takes, up. yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Now, can we do here? Oh, that's. I don't know if it, I don't know if it works, but it looks interesting. Okay. It's getting complex. Oh shh. Right. Ooh. I don't know. I was running out of time. I don't like the way I'm going backwards. Oh, he's got bishop here. But... A rook takes. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening, Bjorn? <laughs> what Try is again. happening? This is just... This is just time now. Oh, shite. No. <laughs> no. Move. <laughs> Move. We had a good position. We don't anymore. No. Oh, nice. We have a good position. Throw in some checks. I'm too slow, man. Ah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we were doing all right there. We were doing okay, yeah. you know. So, so that that? Was, that was quite impossible to. Uh... Yeah, we, 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 we were doing. No, that wasn't too bad. Okay. So I think what we do, so that's kind of the idea. And I, I don't think we'll, we'll look at that game, actually. I think we'll, we'll get playing the viewers, shall we, straight away. I mean, I think uh, I think that was okay for us. This actually was... Okay, the only thing I can say is that this G4 move is one of my recommended ways of playing in the course above. Uh, the safer option I give is Bishop D3. Um, but G4 is very exciting, as we saw in the game. But we have to be careful of the way he played it. Now... This move, h6, I'm just wondering. I, I don't, I mean, maybe I, you know, uh, what the best line is. No one, no one's played this move, h6, so it's kind of a new idea. And I'm wondering if we should actually just go g5 anyway, straight away, because my plan was mm -hmm. a little bit slow. And if he takes, at least we've got a very nice bishop there that you can never kick away. And we've got, mm -hmm. and we can go knight f3, rook g1. So I think in future we should just go g5 there. And this mm -hmm. position to me looks, looks pretty, pretty decent actually. For white, good, good, good. Uh, king side attacking chances. Um, so okay, so I'm going to change my settings. And who do you want to pick? Someone in the chat we can play. Uh, Bjorn, who should we play? So who to play? Well, I think anyone who's given their username, I, I will set up a challenge uh -huh. against them. So, um, and by the way, if you play us and you have the white pieces, you must play. You must play. The Jabava London system. That is the whole point. 
but I think we're going to try to have white in the first couple of games. So we, we will. Uh, we will. Okay. Try. Fish okay. for life chess. What about him or her? Okay. Fish for. Okay. Right. So how do we? So where's that? Okay. Fish. Fish for life. Okay. So Bjorn has picked fish for life chess. So we're going to first. Oh no. Select. We're going to go for five minutes. Is that long enough? Five minutes, you think, Bjorn? Uh, Should we try? Let's yeah, try. let's do it. And you, if we go under one minute, you take over. Okay. If we go under one minute, I'll take over. And we're going to have the white pieces, and we're going to send. We're sending a challenge. Okay. So it says fish for live chess is currently is not currently in live chess. So I'm stopping okay. that straight away. You have to be in live chess in order to play us. Please don't tell us your name um, if so... you're if you're not there. So. What about um, Alfie Dor? Okay, uh, and then we can go for Perno. So where's Alfie Dor? Where's that? Is that a bit up? Let me send you. Um... Yeah, so send me, send me the, send me who we should play their usernames. Du, 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 and we will challenge them. Uh, custom challenge. Are you putting oh. it? Oh. Yeah, I'm doing it in Skype. Ah, okay. That's the other thing. Alfie Door. Okay. Alfie Door. Let's go for that. And we're going five minutes unrated. And we're going to go for the white pieces. Oh, where did your where did your video go? Oh, sorry. Did I mess up? No, I think I did. Ah, oh, it always does this. Bloody silly thing. Okay. Um... Uh, because I sent you a uh, message, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Okay, I'll tell you what. I'll just get you. I'll, I'll stop and get you back on quickly. Okay. Yep. Silly Skype. Silly Skype. And we're gonna have to do that again. We're gonna get there eventually. Don't worry. So let's uh, let's get Skype up and rolling again. And I'll just see if we can get we we'll get Bjorn back on straight away. And hopefully this will work. It's a weird little chessboard I've got next to me now. Okay. Oh, that's good. So, what happened? What on earth happened to that? Okay, right, we've got you back. So, I'm just going to have to get your picture back now. Yes. Can we blame that on Skype? I, I like blaming most things on Skype, you know, that yeah, go wrong. I think. I, let's go. We'll blame Skype if we lose. We're, we, we're blaming. Yeah, let's blame. Okay, there we go. Let's just blame them for everything. Yeah, they are. They, they're the evil. <laughs> <laughs> behind everything okay cool so okay let's do that again so Alfie Dor, we're going to send you a challenge now and we're trying to get through a couple of you uh whoever's in the chat so do do get onto chess.com and i'm going to send the challenge across now alfie so the challenge has been sent so alfie so we're in we are in okay so in. i'll go and first I'm... i'll go first bjorn and yep. you, can, you can take the second move so we're in so okay. D4, and we're only playing the Jabava London. Oh, this one. Oh, right away. <laughs> yeah, he, he wants to get us out of the books. Okay, D5. Okay. Now, in the course above, I actually give taking on C5 as a new mm -hmm. idea. Uh huh. But, but D5 is interesting. So some kind of ideas with this. I'll show you after the game. Yeah. I'll show you very briefly after the game. Okay. Now, it's my move, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Nice C3. Yeah. So let's I struggle go. a lot with these lines, actually. Yeah, that's why I give so taking on c5. Bishop f4. Okay. And I'm going to go e4. Yep. So it's quite a fun way to play. And I'm going to go queen d2. Nice, nice move. The one, move, the two moves we have to watch out for: b5 and. So he's trying to do that. So I'm going to go a4 because I don't want him mm -hmm. going b5. And the other move he should be trying to do is e6. But that's quite hard because we've got d6 on pre now. So over to you, Bjorn. Yeah, I'm going to just long castle. Long castle. You madman. You absolute <laughs> lunatic. That, <laughs> that, that, is, that is really brave. Okay, I'm gonna. We gotta go for checkmate now, and we better we better do it quickly. Okay, Bjorn. Let let let's kill him quickly, Bjorn. Yeah. Before Ooh. he kills us. That was the move I was worried about. Um, 
You're getting all the tricky moves as well. <laughs> so. Yeah. Okay, so what? Maybe we need to defend e4 here, cause just in case he goes b4. You know, he might he might be trying to go b4 and then take it. Yeah, e4. right. Exactly. Yeah. So I think we should just play a little. Okay, so let's just. I think so. Yeah, and then we've got to just push our h pawn and. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. And, and then... hope and pray. <laughs> I think. It looks bad, but we can't see anything or I mean, losing think... immediately. Okay, that's uh, that's not the worst, is it? I think it's okay. I think this is all right. I, I feel mean... like I I feel like. Now we can kind of close up on the queen, queen side. Yeah, let's just, well, just got a checkmate in Bjorn. This is, you know, very simple. Come on, over to you, Bjorn. What are you going to do? I'm going to play uh, h4. Yeah. If you'd have suggested anything else, I would, <laughs> I would have ended the show immediately. I would have just, I would have just logged off. So a, a typical attacking plan. Okay, well I know the next move. Here we go. This is this, this is the way. This is the way we rolled. So maybe your castle's queenside was inspired stuff. He's got some of his own ideas, but you know. Yeah, but we're just gonna take on g6 uh, and pray. Take on g6 and pray. I like oh, it. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so now I'm gonna take on g7 and pray. Yeah. Yeah. So we just need to get that uh, horse horsey away. Yeah. How do we do that? Well, well, first we go in with a with a check. Queen first we go in with a H six check. check. Lovely, lovely. Like what are you doing here? Oh, okay. And now oh, this way. Whose move is it? Mine or yours? Your move. Okay, let's bring that one in. This is this is the way to oh, do yes. it. And uh, is he going to checkmate us? I, I don't think so because whenever he moves one pawn, we move the other. Yeah, pawn. yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it's quite hard. So I go knight uh, g five check. Yeah. Oh, look at that e six square. Wow, oh, lovely. Everything is going well. The Jabal of London, a forced checkmate. Winning. Okay, so now I'd love to take here if you could take with the king, but this looks like this looks like the move to play, yeah. doesn't it? It looks like a good move. But I don't... Okay, so I don't know if we want to give that... That knight is so nice, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. We can. We, oh, over to you. I'll let you do it. Your choice, whatever you want. I'm trying to find something here. Okay, so uh, can I? Hmm. This is time to think, isn't it? Yeah, you. You it's are. It's hard get... to get that knight on d7 away. He's kind of protecting everything. Yes, that knight. That knight is hard to get away. Otherwise, we would be crushing him. Uh, you what? are getting all the tough moves here. It's quite funny. So, guys, yeah, trying to play along yeah, in the chat. And remember, if you do if you do beat us, I'm giving you a free London System DVD. Now that's worth twenty pounds. So not to put any pressure on you, Bjorn. You, you know you do work for Ginger Gem. If you want to see us go bust, then you know just just suggest some bad moves. Simple as that. I'm just going to play uh, Bishop E2 because I don't know what to do. Okay. Now we might have been able to take that one. I don't know. I mean, was was there anything? Maybe maybe we could have got greedy there. I don't know. Maybe I'm not sure, but Bishop E2's an okay move, not a problem. So if you beat us, you win a free DVD. If you like this Jabava London system, you want to know more, do check out 50% sale at Chessable as well. Okay, right now, I'm no, uh, okay. It's your move, yeah. Yes, I'm a little. Oh, we have to we have to speed up as well. Yeah, I'm a little bit scared about his queen getting to b2, Bjorn. Yeah. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay. But let's not worry about that now. Uh... It's a bit scary, this position. That's why I don't like his c-pawn. Speed up, I said. You did say speed up, and then you took 30 seconds on the next move. It, and uh, counting. <laughs> not, uh, not take more. the bishop. Take the bishop. Take the bishop. Okay. <laughs> right. Now. Can he go queen a2 here? He has. Oh, no. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> oh, we cheapoed him. <laughs> that was a bolt from the blue. I mean, are you, uh, you, yeah. you, you, you did. You saved us a DVD. 
you you did mention you did mention that night was the key piece. That's and, true. Uh, <laughs> unfortunately, our opponent played very well, Alfie Daw. He played a very good game. Yes, he did, Alfie. Yeah. But he was a little bit premature there. I mean, I actually think if he goes pawn takes bishop first, now we yeah. can't do this because we lose it was our queen. Really, yeah. I, was, I couldn't see how to get out. This is scary. This is this is scary with a capital S. That queen is 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 moving its way in. We might be able to defend somehow. I mean, uh, at worst case scenario, we can go queen d2. Sorry, queen e3. And if he goes queen here, threatening checkmate, we, we will have to eliminate that pawn yeah. and do something like this. And this is okay because our king has d2. It's not the end of the world, this, by any means. So let's have a little look at the opening because what we are obviously uh, doing today um we're only playing with white and we're playing the jabava london system it's jabava london maybe i should t change the title of the show um i'll change the title of J the show jabava london system hour because that's we're just playing games in jabava london system and if you beat us you win a free dvd Ble uh, i mean bjorn can you say free dvd win a free dvd a free day dvd <laughs> <laughs> As close as I get. <laughs> I, I want you, come on, say that again. Someone's got to clip that. A free day, a free day by day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like it. I like, I like, I like it. <laughs> That's Bjorn's Bjorn's free DVD. Um, by by the way, I, I got confirmation from the Outrage Chess guys, Bjorn, that they're coming to the crypt and they're coming on Friday. So. Oh. Awesome. Should, yeah, it should, awesome. should be fun. Okay, so uh, we were going to have a look at the opening. Now, um, in the course, in the old DVD, uh, which you guys can win, which originally I filmed this DVD, I don't know, like a year or so ago with, Bjor uh, with uh, Blair, uh, and it was two of us. And the course above is probably like three, four times as big as that and much more comprehensive. Um and but in that in the original one i said you should go pawn here but bjorn you might you might be interested in this what i actually give in this position yeah. now is just to take okay. here because i because a lot of people were saying they don't like pushing the pawn on and mm -hmm. I, I give this idea in the course above and the point of this move is really just to go knight c3 and e4 and it's quite like a, a sicilian as well um i don't know what black can play i mean if black goes for example e6 we can go knight here. And after bishop takes here, there's actually a very good move here. And this is what could, I've... Could you share your screen maybe? Because uh, sure. the stream is lagging, so it's hard to follow your your oh, thoughts. Is the stream actually lagging? Oh, it's been no, a bit no. behind. Okay. Yeah, it's just behind uh, sure, sure. the Skype talk. Got it. There we go. Yeah, so in this in this position here, so I'm just going to show you the moves again. Yep, One, if you take on c5, black often plays e6 here just to try to win the pawn back. Mm -hmm. Now, it's not a good idea for us to hold on to that because we get hit okay. by stuff like this. But yeah. what we should do is knight c3. Now, if black takes here, white actually has a very good move in this position, which gives white a at least a little advantage. So this is also open to anyone in the chat um, and to Bjorn. What, what, what can white play here? It's a good move here for white. I mean, it's not a big advantage, but it uh, certainly gives white an advantage. Well, T23, mm. thank you for buying the course on Chessball. That's very, very kind of you, and I hope it does you a, a great deal. And, I mean, the other thing about the course, there's two things you can get. There's, a, I think it's $30 just for without videos or $50 with videos. And you can always upgrade later on, and there's a 30-day money-back guarantee. But a couple of you have got the right move here. Can Bjorn can Bjorn find it as well? Well, no looking at the uh, chat, Bjorn. No I was chat. actually I was considering um, B four. Uh, oh, then Queen D four. Exactly, that was my idea. If yeah, you take you nutter. <laughs> <laughs> I mean B B four. I don't know. I don't really believe this. I mean here, no, maybe Black not. can take here and go here. And maybe maybe this is some compensation because you go bishop yeah. a three, but yeah, exactly, yeah, it's some might, crazy yeah. lines. But um, there's a safer there's a safer way to get an advantage. And, and so knight d four at least put some pressure on the uh, on well, the this, bishop. This is a very good move because if you can win the bishop pair here, because mm -hmm. the bishop is the position is quite open, um, your bishop is going your your bishop pair is going to be very good. And this move this is a very good move because you attack the bishop, 
if the bishop moves anywhere, we come into d6, which is very nice. Because mm -hmm. you get this yep. kind of position and you've got all these dark squares. Right. Which are really nice, you know, like before, but we're not a pawn down. Mm -hmm. And if black plays, I don't know, like queen b6 or something like this, then this position is just a little bit better for white because we play this okay. e4 move and we've got these lovely dark squares. If we, if we can get a bishop to d6, for example, imagine how great that would be. So this idea of c5 taking is quite, I think it's quite a nice idea. And we just want to go knight c3 and then either try to win the bishop pair or go knight c3 and pawn to e4. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're thinking about for the next uh, next game. That's yeah? definitely worth thinking about because I've, uh, I've always been struggling with these lines. So they play c4 and you move on and yeah. Um, yeah, I'm struggling yeah. to get something out yeah. of those lines. That's, a lot of people have said that. And what I've tried to do with this new course is I've tried to give, um, I've, I've, you know, all the feedback that people are giving me and I've tried to change lines to make it easier for people, basically. Mm -hmm. And this, yeah. is, this is one of those lines, yeah. Uh, okay, so I don't, you do the same as the price different in different countries. I don't actually know. I don't, um, it's a good, good, good question. Uh, <laughs> um, uh -huh. I, I, I don't I don't know because it's a chessable product. I think it's fifty percent off for a limited time, but I'm not entirely entirely sure. Uh, I have to check that one anyway. But it, it's half it's, it's money off at the moment. Okay, who are we going to play next? Now I don't know if they're in the chat, but a good friend of mine is in the chat. Maybe I'd be, be cool to play Jerry, but I don't know if Jerry's on Chess.com Bjorn. Um, but we also have. I'm surprised he has a computer. <laughs> oh get that below the belt shot in <laughs> i like it i like it a lot um so <laughs> well we're gonna play uh acm craig and uh, craig is called perno and uh -huh. perno is at the british chess championships bjorn and you, you know what craig did no do you do you want to know what craig did yes please Craig got Ginger Jim tattooed on his bottom. Oh, that's the one. <laughs> well, it was two two people who did. <laughs> it's two people who did. Not just one. There was two, and Craig was one of them. So I think we've got to give Craig a game. At least. <laughs> <laughs> now, I would like to say, Bjorn, anyone who works at Ginger Jim also <laughs> also has to get um, Ginger Jim tattooed on their bottom. Uh, dot com, of course. That was actually yeah, a small text in the in the contract. It I was didn't in the see contract. That. Oh. Uh, you have to have Ginger GM <laughs> or the you've got two options. You either have Ginger GM dot yep. com tattooed on your bottom, or you yep. have my face tattooed on your bottom. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> out of two <laughs> evils, I think it's an easy choice. <laughs> oh God! That, when I said that, I just realized how wrong that sounded <laughs> <laughs> so yeah i'm not even sure you meant the tattoo on the second one if, oh, or if you just no. <laughs> yeah let's just stop there <laughs> let's just stop there let's, <laughs> done now by the way craig it does say you're not currently in live chess i'm afraid to say oh you are now oh good okay so we're playing craig from gibraltar and um is it your turn to go first uh, bjorn uh yes are we white d4 <laughs> d4 okay hello morpheus as well or the morp okay oh he's playing he's playing the dutch now i'm going to keep going with uh our sort of idea and i've done a chapter on this for chessable giving some good ideas okay yeah i haven't seen that so i'm just going to play uh normal bishop uh, bishop f4 okay I think in the in the course, the new course, I give bishop g5 with the idea uh -huh. of sometimes okay. taking and going e4. But this is okay. Now, I'm going to play a mad move. Are you okay? Uh, sure. Let's play g4. Come on. Let's have some fun. Okay. I know, I know you're, a, you're a mad Norwegian Viking, Bjorn, so you, you must appreciate this kind of madness. This, I, I do, uh, and I hope I see the point. <laughs> so do I. I, don't, I mean, I hope I see the point, not you. Okay. So he's grabbed that pawn. Okay, I, I, I just play. Do I play? I play. Uh, I'm just a little bit scared of queen coming in. No, it's all right. Is it? I'm not going to give you too too much advice, but. I 
I mean, I think if the queen comes in, you can always go bishop g3. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so I'm going to try e4 then. Yay, that is the idea. Is that the move? Okay, yeah, cool. that's what I was thinking. I was thinking we can get the center. Mm -hmm. We've opened up some lines later on to attack. We've got a bit of better development. And uh, yeah, it looks it looks like an interesting position anyway. So can I, is it okay if I ask some questions while we're... Yeah, yeah, well yeah. As many questions as you like. So um, I'm going to start to think... Okay, so you see our move. My move. Okay, so I'm going to... He wants to take here. Good move. And then take the pawn. Okay. So I'm going to just develop... Okay. Yeah. Go on. Yeah, I was just, I was just gonna ask if that bishop was going to c4 or d3, basically, what the idea was. Yeah, I, I mean, at the moment, my idea is just to develop. Uh, okay, takes. You sure? He takes c3. You sure? Yes. Okay. Good. I mean, my I think <laughs> my idea was just to quickly develop and, and just see what happens. So, I mean, I don't really have any master mind idea here. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, to be honest. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna take this one now because yep. I'm gonna take us. So I'm gonna do that one and uh I don't know, maybe there's a little bit of play here for us. We've got two bishops, got some open lines, we've got an open G file, his king's on the G file. I don't know if it's enough, but it look, it looks like fun, yeah. So du, 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 du. I'm wondering now if he takes if I can take back Oh, right. uh, can you might maybe I'll let you work out. Yeah, I'll try. You're gonna try. Bishop takes yeah, we're f5. Gonna... Bishop takes f5. Yeah. Okay. Putting ourselves into a double fork, a double pin. Ooh. Oh, he's run away. He's running away, Bjorn. That's a good sign. So we got the pawn. <laughs> we got the pawn back at least. Yes. Okay. So, but now we need to. Right. No, it's your move. Okay. I think I'll go queen d3. Okay, yeah. Just because it defends our bishop, which is a bit loose, uh, and maybe we can castle queenside. Um, and if we get a rook to g1, you know, you never know. So this is what I'm thinking. Stuff like this, maybe. Kind of, kind of, it's all right. Yeah. So. If I can get in bishop g5 now, it looks kind of annoying for him. Yeah, mm. maybe, maybe bishop g5 is, is I mean, I, I might keep that. Okay, so he's trying to swap off. Oh, okay, so he's just going to swap. He's playing well. He's playing good chess. Mm. Yeah, I think I'll just take the bishop. I don't yeah. really see. Yeah. Why not? Let's take that one off. And I think next... And then you can decide what to do with the <laughs> okay, <cheers>. bishop. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, think the, I think what I'll do, I'll, I'll develop our last piece and just put the knight to stop stop the eight, this uh -huh. one and guard our bishop. And we can decide, you know, if we want to castle queenside or put a rook on g1 and this kind of this kind of stuff next. This this I don't know. It's probably roughly even this position. So Craig is playing playing a good game. Okay. Um, I am going to castle queenside. You love. <laughs> you love... If I do castle, like castle queenside. You love castling queenside. Here he comes. <laughs> okay, right. So I think we're going to now use the open file yep. and hopefully checkmate him first. So interesting, interesting stuff. This is the plan anyway. Can we checkmate him before he checks, checkmates us? I think we're a bit quicker here than him. Yep. I like our position. If he plays g6 now, can I take it? I bloody well hope so. <laughs> I mean, that, that's the kind of move that I would... Yeah, why not? Just go. Yeah, I'm it. just going to pre-move takes. <laughs> <laughs> so if he goes G6, okay. Oh, I didn't. Oh, he's found a good go defense. He's, he's oh, yeah, that's very nice, yeah. Very clever play. It looks like, Craig, you've been improving somewhat. I'm going to play Bishop H6 anyway. You're going in. Okay. Yeah. So Bjorn is super aggressive. He doesn't... Bjorn is not a retreater. He's a full frontal attacker. That's right. Has your have you traced your family back to Bjorn to Vikings? Do you know if there's any? Uh, have you done any of that? Any DNA history? Don't feel I need to. It's quite obvious. <laughs> it's it's... <laughs> cool. okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna move this one here. I'm gonna attack. Okay. It. Yeah. Good. Try try <laughs> bring bring up some more pieces. 
quite obvious you you are a full blooded Viking, yeah. No, I think it's, somebody did some um, yeah. some searching, and the only thing they found was like a Swedish. Uh, I think my jinx go back to Sweden. I mean, there were also Vikings, but yeah. um, like a Swedish. Uh, what is? Oh, sorry, I need to think now. Yeah. It's getting quite intense now, but the Rook G1, Rook DG1. Okay, he's playing very well. Yeah. Very, very, very good play by Craig. Stop it, Craig. You're not supposed to be this good. You're, well, you are. You're, you're obviously improved, Craig. Nice, nice work. Okay, right. And is it my move? Yeah. Right, now those knights are annoying and our knight's not doing anything exactly yeah. so i'm gonna try and swap our passive knight for his good defender so let's let's go for that one so very interesting game isn't it very interesting position he's defending g7 with like everything and we're trying to attack it with everything yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's uh, a very interesting position this one very interesting Okay, so over to you, Bjorn. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, I think I want to take the knight first. Okay. Before I do anything. This looks like a good move. Yeah. This looks like a very good move. And you know what? And now you can sack. Well, I'm just going to take that. Or you there. can do the... Yeah. I, I'm well. just going to take that, and I'll come back and sack it in a minute. But it won't be a sack then, because we've won a piece. So... That's very yeah. true. Yeah, that was so a little blunder there from Craig, who, who played very well up to that point in the game. So, Craig, this is looking looking tough now, but we'll keep we'll keep playing on. Over to you, Bjorn. Uh, Rook G five. You still want to sack it, don't you? I know what you like. You still want to come in. I was kind of more thinking what happens when he moved to king now, just. To... <laughs> oh, right, okay. Well, I guess I'm just going to come... F oh, we've got to use Harry. Yeah, yeah. Well, we can't play a game of chess without Harry. Uh, someone's... Okay. Yeah, Harry 5. Harry 5, like it. Does the London System course feature Simon singing London Calling? <laughs> <laughs> Extended version, I think. It does. London Calling. Is that The Clash? London Calling? Is London calling the clash? I don't know. Don't know. Okay. Is it my move or yours? It's your move. Okay, I'll go check. Pats the sees one. It is the clash. Yeah. We're actually. Uh, yeah. Queen takes G. Oh, boom! You're just you're just getting brutal now. Okay, let's line them up. Line them up. And your move, Bjorn, you've got a good move here. Uh, Queen F8 looks good. Ah, oh, nicely done. <laughs> I will pat you on the back if I could. That was that was good stuff. Good game. Um, and I have to say, Craig, um, well played as well. You played much higher quality, Craig, in that game than I think in some of our previous encounters. So I hope you are... Well, it looks like you're improving. So good game, Craig. Only went a little bit wrong at the end there. You, you played very well. So keep it up, mate. I hope to buy you a beer It's interesting soon. this... Um, um, it, it's very interesting that you've uh, created something uh, for against the Dutch. Because um, I, I love playing the London against the Dutch. And not because I'm getting good positions, but because it's almost always so fun. The, the games become so crazy. Yes, they do. Yeah, I mean, one, one of the reasons I um, suggested something... Um, that, you know, against the Dutch as well. I mean, I was too, and I wanted to make it like a full course. But the line, I'll show you what I suggested, Bjorn. It was actually, instead of bishop f4, when they put their knight on this square, it was actually bishop g5. And this is just a little bit more trickier for black to deal with because um, if black plays e6 here, which is like a normal move to avoid doubling the pawns, what could be a good move here? Uh, Bjorn, and this is just... this is why I like this uh, this 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 line in this position. What what would people play here as white? And Kasparov's actually played this this as white as well. 
and, and other people. So, what is the move to play as white here? Mm. And, you, and it's not a, it's with the bishop on f4. This next move is not as strong, not very good. But with a bishop on g5, this next move is much much better. Do I have something in the Dutch repertoire against the Jabava London? Well, I, I have a look at the London system in the Dutch chessboard course and vice versa. Uh, so maybe E4. Uh, yeah, yeah. And Tam Crude also See, got there's this. A lot e, of pressure. Yeah, E4 is a good move. If you can ever play E4 against F5, I, I often yeah. find this is a good way to play. Mm -hmm. The point is, if they take it, you take with your knight. Mm -hmm. And now that they don't have a pawn on F5, you know, you can aim for H7. So you can quickly, you know, start attacking over here. Right. And often, you know, with the pieces coming, this diagonal is for black. So this is like one of the ideas of this 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 line uh, against the Dutch. Bishop g5. Probably the best move here is d5 from black. Okay. Um, you can double their pawns now, but actually I, I prefer playing e3 to see what they're going to do next. Mm -hmm. And now if they play e6 here, you can actually now, I believe, try g4 as we did in the game if they take That's it you can game. even try something like h3 and the point is if they take this one you take here uh -huh. and you have again this bishop coming here you have the knight coming into g6 yeah this looks fun you have a you have some interesting gambit -y lines so this is uh this is this is like one way to play and i mean it, if he plays h6 looks like a move many player would play yeah and I'm just thinking, can you uh, take the knight and play the queen in? You or can, does that make but, sense? But then they go oh, no, maybe that's, does Yeah, we... exactly. That doesn't actually help that much. The, but there is a better line here. And I think the better line is, well, either, I think knight f4, yeah? Because this is one of the re good reasons about not having a pawn on h2. Yeah, you okay. You have this pin. Right. And you have this lovely square here for the knight, yeah? Black's, mm. king, Black's king could be in a bit of trouble here, yeah? Mm. So it's an interesting, aggressive way to play. Uh, against the Dutch, you know. Food for thought. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, let's play um, Fish for Life, who is... Yes. Two, he's over 2,000 rated, Bjorn, so... Oh, man. Are, are we going to take him down, man? Um, Alfie Dorn, <clears throat> you can watch the stream again. Um, it's in the archives here you someone will tell you how to do it so okay fish for life um we're gonna play you now i hope you've set it up so we have the white pieces you have well done fish for life come on bjorn let's not lose a dvd today okay so let's d4 d4 okay what is what, what's your rating bjorn someone's asking uh it's about 1800 in blitz on chess.com okay about 1800 fish for life you're in always oh, d <laughs> <laughs> It's your move. <laughs> oh, it's my move. Well, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm, we just had this. I'm gonna do the same again. We've got to do the same again. So bishop g5 then. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Let's see what I learned. The thing is, fish for life oh. might be watching the stream. <laughs> well, it's definitely watching the stream. That's happy. Okay, I'm glad it's your move. <laughs> oh, is it my move? Okay, e4 Bjorn. We just looked at this man. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> And okay, now now you... And if he takes, what was the point? Okay, I'm going to take back. You and... take back. Uh, and in this position, you, you just aim to develop quickly, Bjorn, and maybe maybe do your oh, favorite... Oh yeah, take back. I take c4. Okay. So you aim to develop quickly and maybe play your favorite move, castling queenside. You put the pawn on Harry 4 and have some fun. So, okay, so first of all, we have to be a little bit careful here. So yep. it's my move because he is now breaking the pin, so he's threatening to take on knight. Yep. He's broken the pin, but I would suggest that I play this one mm -hmm. because I want to keep my knight here uh, for the time being. Yeah. Okay. Um, and I'm going to play... Uh... I'm not going to give you any help here. Well, I'm just going to get the bishop out, I think. Bishop. Uh, D3 looks like a good square for the bishop for me. Okay. Now... The oh, other... I'm actually... Okay, yeah. You're actually sacking. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I just <laughs> realised Did you only just realise that you're actually sacking? Yeah, sacking. Yeah. Is that what you call it? Sacking. Yeah. That's what... You... Okay. Not, not blundering, though. 
No, no, this is sacking. <laughs> this this is sacking. Okay, I just wanted to clarify that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That this 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 wasn't a blunder. This was a, a sacrifice. <laughs> our, okay. Our opponent is. Um, <laughs> he looks confused now. Can you see his face somehow? I don't know. I, I no, no, but it is taking a long time now. So okay, uh, okay. Yeah. So I like your sacking move there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, interesting stuff. Um, and I mean, knight to f3 was the other way of playing. And okay, so he he's not falling for any of our bilio bilio ball crap. It's quite, yeah, it's quite okay. sad. Okay. So it's my my move. Yeah. Yep. Thanks, mate. Welcome. <laughs> okay oh now if i go check he goes g6 i don't see i can go i can i can go into h6 and pray okay let's go for that this is this is now being coined the bjorn variation of the dutch <laughs> well defense. you gave me the next move so queen h6 i don't know if it's a good move bjorn that you shouldn't always take take my advice but okay we'll do it the, this is the <laughs> this is the Bjorn the Bjorn sacrificial line. Um, the upside is that we can we can now castle queenside. Maybe. Oh, and we can. No, no, we can like legally. Okay. Yes, we can. Yeah. Uh, it's probably not good, but uh, okay. So is it my move? It is. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So we have knight f3. We have castling, yep. or we have knight g5. But I'm not threatening to take there, or am I? I don't know. Looks like fun, knight g5. He's defending. This is quite a good move, this one, unfortunately. That's a good move. He's defending stuff. Well, I'm just doing a little bit of calculation here. Occasionally we have to do... I want to go knight g5, but I'm a bit worried about bishop g7. Bishop takes g6, pawn takes queen, takes king f8. And by the time I've worked this out, we're going to be lost on time. <laughs> so you know what? I'm going to castle, and just and just say we've got some development here. So okay, I'm going to do your favourite move, Bjorn. Oh no, this is not fair. It's not fair. That's not that's not fair, is it at all? Boo! This guy might be winning a DVD, man. I think we need to take it off, actually. Really? It, you you might be right, but it's just so grim. Yeah, it's horrible, but. But it's worse if we don't, I think. Yeah, you might. Dying, be uh, it's my move, so I, I uh, just take the queen. Okay. Wah, wah, wah. Okay, right. So I'm going to develop. So we have still got some hope because of my best eight. friend. Come exactly. on, come on, Harry. Pre move, <laughs> pre -move, pre -move. Harry four. But if he goes well, D five, we might exact, we might have to D five. Yeah, we might have to rethink that one. <laughs> All other moves. Well, we got we got good development here, haven't we? We have got Except good if development. Except it takes on B two, obviously. Yeah, it's not so bad, is it? It's not so bad at all. No, no, it's not. It's not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. So, okay. Is it your move? Uh, H four. Yay! Here we come. A vicious attack on the king. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Against what? <laughs> A vicious, a vicious attack with Harry, and our opponent is quaking in his boots at the <laughs> anticipation of landing the killer blow. Okay, right, Ooh. so I'm going to now... Is it my move? Yep. I'm not going backwards, I'm going here. Right. And I don't think we could go back. We have to go forwards. There's only, there's only one way, isn't there? Only one way. Even if it's the, the wrong way. Now, I want to sort of take that one, don't I? But he stopped yeah. that, okay. Okay, so rook e1, rook uh, d e1. Nice. We've got a good move beyond. We've got a little bit of pressure here. Yeah, it's I not so I, easy for him to it's not. I think he, defend I think, that one. I think he could have gone e5 last move if we'd have taken on h7, gone e4. But now now we stopped that e pawn from moving and we, we've got some, our pieces are quite good. Compensation beyond, compensation. We haven't lost a DVD yet. No. no, and uh, time is now equal. Yeah, I, I think your sacrifice is going to catch on somewhat. <laughs> you know, is Magnus is Magnus watching the stream? Yeah. Uh, so he's playing the Fisher random, so he he won't get anything out of this opening. Oh, of course. It's a Fisher yeah. random World Cup. This. Okay. Oh, okay, interesting. My move is it? My move. 
Yep. Well, I'm just going to take it. Just take it. I'm not even going to think about it. I'm just going to take it. It might be interesting, but I'm going to take it anyway. A pawn is a pawn. But my opponent didn't have a very good way of defending the pawn on e6. So oh. I don't think he could defend it. So I think he was forced to play. Forced if bishop play takes, then I pre-move rook takes. And we got a good position now. This is this is great, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. You uh, very very imaginative gambit that you played there, Bjorn. And your your move, yeah. yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, I mean uh, this this. Oh, this is actually oh. yeah. This is horrible oh, to defend. He's resigned because he, he can't he can't really move the knight. He can't defend he, it either. I mean, I think he could go here. He's losing in the where? Oh, sorry. C six. He could have played. Um. And he, then rook well, e. Then, well, then he goes here. He goes king g7. There's nothing obvious here. I mean, because he's covering the e7 square. So. I mean, okay. this. Is it getting out? But, okay, yeah. I mean, so the... you, t you take on h8. Well, you could take an h8. I mean, I think a better move here is that. Okay, just, maybe not. Maybe just take this pawn. And we're a pawn up with the attack then. But the game yeah. sort of goes on. So. I mean, if we have a look at the opening, okay, let's just, again, that's what we're trying to do today. We're just playing. You, sh you should probably get um, the computer evaluation just to see how good my sack was. We, we can, okay, I, I'm, I'm worried about this, but we get the computer evaluation. <laughs> and uh, let me just, I have to just get another screenshot so everyone at home can see. Um, if Bjorn's, okay, we'll put it over here for now how how it likes Bjorn's fin. So the computer valuation is over here. I mean, we played pretty much perfect. 96% accuracy. Can you No believe... blunders. The one mistake. I guess that was my sack, but... Wow, 96%. Can you... That's, that's, that's not bad, Bjorn. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. Definitely. It's an understatement, yeah? Okay, so... Okay, so let's have a look. So this opening, if you get the Dutch and you're able to get E4 in... Um, as you can see, the computer already likes White's hmm. position, and uh, I totally agree that White is just better in this position. This is why I like this line against the Dutch. Hmm. And in this position after here, Bishop takes f6 is the main move. But the simple way to play this is to you do want to go Bishop d3 because that's a very nice diagonal. But mm -hmm. there's, there's no point losing this pawn. It's quite a good pawn. I mean, I think no, no, yeah. in in theory, Knight to f3. Is, is a better move. And there's been some games here. The Gary Kasparov game continued castling. Bishop d3. And now I think it went d6. And Gary, I think, played h4 at some moment with the idea of just coming here and mm -hmm. start an attack over here. And he went queen e2 and he castled queen side. And you can see here, well, the computer's evaluation gives it as basically like a plus one a advantage. Up, yeah. So it's, it's quite nice. And you see h4, look at that h4 is excellent we know that computer you don't need to tell me <laughs> that h4 is an excellent move we 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 are we are yeah so so okay so so good stuff Bjorn. so we're on 100 percent. can you believe it 100 percent. not bad okay who's up next then so who, who who um let's see if anyone else wants to play us in the chat you've got to be on chess.com in in order to play us and you've got to tell me your um, there, were, there was a winston check hill is he still in there Winston, did we play him? Winston Checkhill, I like that. That's a nice name. Well, J JS is here, who's a subscriber. So, should we give JS a go? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, JS is, uh, is that the one who's coming to the crypt, or is this um, a. I don't think JS is coming to the crypt. No, no, no. Okay, yeah, yeah. Um, we'll play JS, and then we'll play Bry Bryro uh, after that, because they're both subs. And then we'll play Winston Checkhill, Checkhill after that, yeah? So, yep. sub, subs, subs come first. I feel and um, okay. How do I get back to the playing arena? Let's let's play that one. So if you just tuned in, what we're doing today, we're doing we're only playing as white. Me and Bjorn, who we're sort of doing a, a relaxed lesson today. Bjorn, I'd say yeah. Yeah. And we're we're looking at the Jabava London system. This new opening. If you like the opening, it's on fifty percent off at Chessable. If you follow the link that comes up in the chat uh, for for a limited time. Uh, so we're, we're, we're really concentrating on that one. So JS, did I say JS first? I did. Okay. So yeah. J, JS wants to play five minute plus five seconds of move. Are you okay with that? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. Let's do that then. And, oh no, we're black. I'm boarding. Abort. <laughs> abort. Abort position. Okay. I'll challenge you, JS. Maybe that's easier. So let, let's, let's do that. 
Okay, we'll try again, JS. We're, we're black again, JS. Oh no, look, let me let me challenge you. Because, okay, I will challenge you, JS. That sounds like the easy way of doing it. Custom challenge. Maybe JS wanted to play the Jabava himself? Oh, maybe. Do you want to play Do you want to play the Jabava, JS? The... I think we'll keep it like this for now. Uh, the okay, yeah, yeah, sure. The challenge is coming, and we play... Oh, uh, he wants to play 5 plus 5, so okay, we'll make... We, we can That's do fine. That. We can do that. 5 minutes, I just have to... Plus 5, okay. Unrated, and... We are on challenge you now, Jess. We're in. And okay, uh, do you want to go first, Bill? Um. Yes, sure. Are we in? We're in. Okay, so D four done. In we go. Remember, if you do beat us today, you win a free DVD. A DVD. Okay, so I'm going to go knight c three. So the first three moves of this are really D four, knight c three, bishop f four. Yeah, bishop f4. Okay, in we go. Life is, are they really in the same room? <laughs> no, we're not. We're actually sitting no, we're out. Not. Yeah. We're, we're actually in the same outside. This is, uh, we decided to go to the patio in Greenland. Can't you see the northern lights behind us? That's how good the effects are, Bjorn. Your green screen is working magic. Simon was out all day, so he's a little bit more tan than me. That's right. I had a bit of the green light tan. Exactly. Whose move is it? Is it my move or yours? Yeah, it's your move. Oh, okay, sorry. I'm going to go E4 because we normally go E3. But if we get a chance to go E4, why, why, exactly. why, why don't right. we not? Yeah. Yeah. How you handle Bishop B4. Well, that is in the course above. And I'll tell you after this game briefly how we handle Bishop to b4 so i'll show you after the game when we have a little analysis because bishop b4 is certainly one of the most critical lines i think in the future in jabava london but i think it's 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 not a worry it seems to have been catching on lately more and more mm. people are playing that against london lots of people are playing it and it's something in the first dvd i didn't talk about a lot but bishop d3 good move but in the course above i do talk about it in in a lot more detail so yeah do I cover the parrot variation? <laughs> I can't even remember what the parrot <laughs> is, funnily enough, you know? So, okay, it's my move, yeah? Yeah. You know what? There's nothing wrong with developing. So, I know which way you want to castle, though, Bjorn. Yeah, oh. exactly. You're kind of forcing <laughs> me to castle the wrong way now. Ah, I'm not forcing you to you, know? castle. you can castle wherever oh, you want to castle. Oh, yeah. uh, castle, sh short castle now. Are you going to castle short? Yes. Okay. Ooh, I thought you might <laughs> want to get, get your king over the other way, you know? So, okay, right. Oh. Now, I feel like it's time to um, do something. I'm going to go e5. You know, let, let's, let's open him up. We're castled, he's not castled. Exactly, so, yeah. So when your opponent's king is not castled, you want to open up the position and throw your pieces towards it. Yeah, this is a this is a magical bottle. This, by the way, it's a magical bottle. Now, I, I'm streaming all the way up to Halloween, as some of you may or may not be aware. And um, it's a good move. It's a good move. And uh, one of the questions I was asking, and if you're in the chat now, you can have a, a go at answering it. Is what outfit should I wear on Halloween? Now, I'm happy to put makeup on to dress up, whatever you guys want. What should I wear on Halloween? I won't have a green screen. On Bishop Hall D2. Bishop D2. Okay. I won't have a green screen on Halloween because I'll be at home. I'm at the office at the moment. But one great idea, Bjorn, yesterday uh, was that I, I, I basically, this is, unfortunately, I won't be able to do it because I won't have a green screen. But it was, I should wear all green. <laughs> except for my head so i just have a floating head because then if it's green i got my body will be the same as back so literally for halloween my head which may or may not have a ben feingold mask on yep. will, will be floating around so i thought i like that idea okay right so my move here and i'm gonna play g4 Ooh. oh and he's gone straight back look at that he instantaneous chess from js where a cute okay 
sexy nurse outfit someone's saying oh dear aren't you gonna uh, be in the crypt rookie halloween? one no i'm not gonna be in the crypt on halloween the dates for the crypt and this is a closed event so you have to contact me if you want to come but here are the dates for the crypt it's the 23rd of november my move okay that's an yep. easy one i'll take that one Someone's saying a zombie Viking would be nice. I mean, these would be great ideas, but I'm, I'm certainly no makeup artist. So I think the idea of me trying to make myself up as a zombie Viking would be one, one step too far. <laughs> you know, I'll probably just look like a drag queen or something like that. So we might have to go a bit easy on the, on the makeup. I think, yeah, I'll try Queen C1. Queen C1. Okay. Having a little nibble, are you, sir? having a little i nibble. just don't know what to do oh i don't believe you but there's a yeah. couple of ideas now so there's a couple of ideas. i can see i can see you know he can go for c6 against the the other idea potentially yeah if this is the other idea which i like yeah nice that was idea. the other idea yeah spock chess says just bought the jabrava london system thank you very much sir the link it comes up in the chat and it's you know you get your 30 day money back guarantee so even if you buy it you don't like it chessable will give you your money back have you can have a look at it see how you get on uh, so thank you for buying it spot chess and I, I hope it helps your i hope it helps your chess okay right so my move yeah 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 my move tempting to take that pawn <laughs> oh that's because you're an absolute lunatic, Bjorn. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're only attacking with one bishop, but... You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, uh... But it's always tempting. I didn't say it was good. <laughs> no. Okay, so... Um, I don't know if Jerry's still in the chat. Is Jerry there? He might have had to gone back to work. Which is a... Uh... I don't know what to do here, Bjorn. I, I don't know. You know what? I'm, I, I, I'm not sure. So, I'm going to... Oh, just. Play, I'm just going to play H3. I'm going to let you decide, Bjorn. That's okay. Str- I'm going to let the strong... Yeah, we, I think we needed a couple of uh, quick moves. I've okay. spent too much time. Okay. Uh, so, a quick move. Uh, I'm going to go King G2. Nice. Exactly what I was thinking of. I like it. You know, maybe we can build up later yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. So. Okay, okay. Quick, quick move. I'm going to go... Uh, let's, let's do it. Let's, let's go. Yeah, here. exactly. I, yeah. I don't know if it's good or bad. A Viking drag queen sounds nice. I, I you know, that, that, that does sound. It's quite an interesting. <laughs> it's quite an interesting idea for for a Halloween outfit. Viking drag queen. It's quite hard to see where to break through here. It is, but I mean, also for our opponent, um, he's yeah. got, his knight can't move. It's not so clear what he should be doing in, in this position either. Was knight b5 a threat? Well, the problem with knight b5 was Ooh. you can always go c6. So I didn't I didn't like knight b5 because of this move. Whose move is it? Um, oh, it's my move now. I okay. don't know. Is it? I don't... Okay. Uh, well, now I want to play uh, queen e1. Okay. I was thinking h4 there might might also be quite good. Okay, yeah, yeah, because he doesn't have the protection anymore. He's no okay. longer, and then we could try to get our knight right. into g6 and open yeah. up the rook and maybe open up the bishop. But queen e1 looks good because you're uh, centralizing the queen uh, against his king. Can't be a bad move. This one. Hundred percent with the Jabava. Just got a message on chess.com. Are you still there? I think that means I'm playing too slowly. <laughs> oh, really? From from who? No, no, just uh, system message. Okay. Just because I'm watching your game, I guess. All oh, right, okay. Just... Okay. Oh, from chess.com? Yeah, yeah. All oh, right, okay. So you're not scared of him coming in? Oh, he's not coming in. He's going backwards. I wasn't really okay. scared of the knight coming. I thought we could always go queenie too. So he's playing super solid. I'm going to... Uh, take on g5. H takes g5. Nice. It's time. It's time. Time to go. Time to go. Go forwards. I feel. Well, 
Only if we can. Oh, is it my move? It is. Yep. Right. I'm going to play this one. Yeah. Maybe. I think I see your point. <laughs> well, I, I, I kind of yeah. want to double rooks as well as as my secondary point. And of course, the first point should be should be. Thank you, Oliver, for joining. Uh, in. He's playing well. He's playing really well. Yeah, he's playing that good was March. Good move. Um, yeah, that was a very good move. Okay, rook uh, h3. Nice move. Positional, positional chess. You play for the h file. <laughs> the Russians would be proud. I got a lot. I got in a lot of trouble the other day. Um, well, not a lot of trouble, but I had a bunch of Russian, Russian uh, people on Twitter all having a go at me because I think Fide announced that the one of their wild wild card candidates was this guy who did quite well in the Isle of Man, some Russian uh -huh. youngster. Okay. And, and I was saying, oh, would he have been if if he wasn't Russian? Would he would he have got? I actually got it wrong at my end because it wasn't the rules beforehand, but it's funny. All these Russians suddenly got on Twitter and like, don't you criticize the Russian oh, no. Federation? Oh. I was like, bloody hell. Oops. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> I've got to watch my door handles now, you know, the poison, the poison door. Hand. I better, I better just shut up before they actually do poison me. Okay. Right. Uh, yeah. I was thinking about this and uh, it's hard to see. Okay. Uh, but night E2. I like that move. I was I was gonna I was gonna play that move anyway. To, yeah. Yeah. You need more pieces, I guess. Yeah. But he's playing very well. He's playing very well. I don't know if we could have taken on G five or not. I wasn't sure there. Maybe. Probably not. I think he goes bishop takes, unfortunately. Yeah. So. Stop mm. digging, says the hand. Yes, I love the Russians really. I love all <laughs> Russians. They're they're my favourite people. Oh, it's your move. I don't have anything against any country. He's and protecting I, everything. I w yeah, he's playing very well. I mean, I'd love to go to Russia. I've never been to Russia, so but I'm... I've been to Russia a couple of times. I I love oh, it really? there. Do you? Yeah, been to Moscow okay. and um, uh, Saint Petersburg. Saint Petersburg is maybe very nice, yeah, isn't it? That's very very nice. Your move, Moscow your... is a little bit too large and yeah yeah. Your move, Bjorn. Oh, it's my move. Yeah. Oh, you play here. What is he doing? Not much. No. Uh, uh, Winning on time. Uh, night H five. Have you been? Have you been to Russia on a holiday? Or was it business? Holiday. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Just holiday. And what, what did you get up to? Just. Shenanigans, good words. <laughs> well, it's your move again, Bjorn, but we're getting It's my to... move again. Yeah, oh, I, I play uh, B3. B3. Keep your eyes on the wheel, Bjorn. If we get down to 25 seconds, I'll take over, yeah? Yeah, yeah. He's playing so well. Uh, for, for a... The knight on F3 is kind of in the way now. It is. It is. Well, well spoiled. I guess I guess I should have moved that instead of the beep on that. No, that's okay. No rush. For, a guy, for JS, who's only 1100. Yeah. He's playing bloody well. Bloody good game, JS. Okay. Bloody good show, old boy. Let's watch our G porn as well. I did. Okay. We want to go F four, but I don't want to take on G four. So I think I'm going to go. Yeah. I think I'm going to go Rook G three and try to play G four to break uh -huh. it. Open. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. JS works for the Tiller twos. Okay. Elephant Bush is saying, "How often are you planning on streaming?" Well, the uh, the schedule is below. If you if you scroll Your down, mo so do scroll down. Uh -huh. Oh my word! Simon is live. No, I'm not. This is a pre-recording. That's, <laughs> that's why I just said that. I'm just guessing that you're writing that. Okay. I I'm gonna pre pre move F4. Good stuff. That's it. That's going to discombobulate him. 
Oh, you get five seconds of move, Bjorn, so we're okay. Oh, that's true. He's okay Ooh, as well. Ooh, okay. He's not scared. Uh... He's not. Rook F1. I like this. There's a... There's a... Oh, is it my move? Yep. Okay. Well, that's a good move. Uh, let's see. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Oh, okay. D4. Someone said that they took GCA so, uh, a Russian and the drinking age in Russia is 14. Which is... What's the age in Norway? <laughs> is it my move? My move. Okay, I'll go here. We'll link the camera, Mio. We'll link the camera. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi. This is the future world champion of chess. Hello, future world champion of chess. Verdens mester i schakkesnart, ikke sant? Hey. What's your name? Mio. Mio? Hello, Mio. Jeg ser ham. Jeg ser du deg selv. Ja. Mio, you better play move soon, otherwise we'll lose on time. Oh, shit. Du tar OT til. F5. F5? Jeg kommer ned på. F5. Ok, jeg snakker. So, does Mio play much chess? He played a lot uh, last year when he was uh, Brilliant. Uh, five years old. Very nice. Uh, now it's more Ninjago. Now it's more what? Knight takes. Oh, he... right. Nice. Nice. Your move. And F6. What does Mio, what does Mio play? Ninjago now? is a Lego uh, okay. thing. Okay. Your move, Bjorn. Uh, takes f6. That's such he a takes nice f6. move, isn't it? A double check win of the queen. That's pretty good. That, that's, that is a good move. <laughs> that is a little, little, great little move. So, uh, well, well played, JS1000. That was pretty, uh, pretty, pretty good, good game. And I did say I'd answer some questions on these variations uh, that we had here. Uh, so basically, what we've been doing today, and we'll probably play, should we play one more game, Bjorn? Something like that? Yeah, sure. We'll do that's one fine. more. Because it looks yeah. like little little Bjorn is little Bjorn is is <laughs> wants uh, wants wants some attention there. So we're exactly, yeah, yeah. So we'll play one more game and we'll call it a day. I mean, the schedule for my stream is below. Tomorrow's a bit of a drunk and crazy one. Um, but I did. So what we've been doing today? We've been playing the Jabava London, which is the course I'm selling at the moment. Uh, well, through Chessable, Chessable is selling, and um, this line here with now bishop f4 and bishop b4 is becoming very popular as people are saying so i want to show you some things very quickly which i have in the course which might help you out but one thing i talk about in the course is that in this position a move and i give a variation here that is that is really worth thinking of is the move e4 mm -hmm. right now yeah. this move if you're able to go e5 fantastic um, and there's actually a winning variation here if bishop b4, and lots of people play bishop b4 here, Bjorn. But this is actually now, I don't know about winning, but it's massive advantage for white after e5. And again, this is all in the course. Yep. And now the knight should come in here, really, otherwise going a bit pathetic. So let's say it goes here. And now the strong move, queen g4. Uh huh. And after knight takes c3, take here. Oh my. <laughs> I know. And this is a really exciting position. But the point is, we can play c3, and there's no good check with the knight. Mm -hmm. And black is in so much trouble over here with our bishop coming to one of these two squares. The computer, I think, gives this as basically plus um, two, two and a half pawn advantage. This position already. Yeah, I mean, let's say you wow. go. Let's say you go rook f8. Now, can you find the best move here, Bjorn? There's one move here which I, I really. I really like because at the moment bishop h6 is defended by the bishop on b4 but the computer gives a very nice move here which um you know which is good but js you played very well there you did well done js it was a good game so what is a good move here hello i am brick top you're a sub now oh brio we did say we play you so we're gonna brio 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 we'll play you next so what is the good move shall i, shall I tell you bjorn Bishop g5. Bishop g5. He can even maybe play us. Well, bishop e7. He's a piece up. Okay, yeah, yeah. So the best move here is a3. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it's just quite a nice position, yeah. So the idea is, uh, the idea. If the, you can get in, c uh, bishop h6. 
we've got the idea is if he moves back here when we just take here and we're actually a pawn up uh -huh. and okay. uh, you know because yeah. we've got our piece back we can even be two pawns up the h pawn should win the game uh we also have a very nice center so this is uh, mm -hmm. uh but i mean the only the only slight problem with this move order and this is after e4 black can now play d5 and yep. it's back into a classical french so in the course mm -hmm. above i give one variation which is a bit of a sideline that you can play here as white and i give the variation pawn here knight d7 and then this move which is very rare and the idea of this is to play c3 and just keep your pawns like this right. which anand anand has played quite a lot so this bishop b4 stuff's quite interesting and i mean for example here if bishop b4 you can play e4 again but now you get the winner where french and mm -hmm. this is another line in the french where i, I suggest a sideline of a3 but if you do decide on playing bishop f4 and knight f6 you get this position which is very uh very uh normal and i spent mm -hmm. you've had this a lot bjorn the yep. line the line i give here is e3 with the idea of bishop d3 and knight e2 now i think the knight's best here okay uh if you can get these two moves and you're doing well for example castles let's say here b6 knight e2 can i just say if, mm -hmm. if you played uh knight e4 right away yeah knight e4 after e, uh, after e3 okay or after e after e3 well knight d5 is probably even better actually here oh, okay yeah this 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 move here yeah. um and now knight e2 is what you have to do and okay here yeah. because now it looks a little bit weird to block your bishop up but... it looks a bit weird to block the bishop up but our idea is to go a3 and try okay. to uh, you know win the dark squares because if uh -huh. he gives up this bishop and probably the best line here for example and jabava had a game in this is where black sort of cut takes it and then i mm -hmm. think we should take with a pawn and then after castle jabava played a3 okay i don't think black wants to take this knight now these double pawns can be actually a strength for us because they increase our, our grip on the center mm -hmm. but the line i give here is an improvement on jabava's d5 it's, it's just the move g3 because now you can see the bishop mm -hmm. actually is making quite a lot more sense and if you get the bishop to this square i think it's quite nice because the bishop on c8 is quite a bad piece I mean, maybe it's not enough right. for an advantage, but may, I, I prefer to be white personally in these positions. Um, yeah. So this is this is this is what I give you. Ca you castling uh, short. Uh, uh, don't have to. It's up to you, Bjorn. You can do yeah. do whatever the hell you want to do, Bjorn. But, also, <laughs> queenside this. <laughs> well, I mean, if you want to go queenside, maybe put the pawn G four then. That's that's more fun. Oh uh, yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah? Yeah. So I'll probably go yeah G four. I mean, this is interesting stuff. Yeah, just go for it quite fun get the knight to g3 get the bishop to d3 checkmate them. Yep. i mean there's a couple of ways you can play so it's interesting stuff okay right so okay you, so one more game one more game bjorn because i know uh obviously you've got you've got stuff going on there and yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll play a straight five minute we won't play of increment now and we will play with white again and let's i'm, I'm challenging bryro now um so you should see the challenge bryro and this is the last game we have for beyond today now if you haven't had a chance to uh if you haven't had a chance to play us today i'm awfully sorry but you will be you'll have another chance next time we do this and on the schedule below you will see that there's a sub uh blitz session against me on saturday so um for example who became a sub it was i am bricktop mate is that is that named after the snatch character maybe I was we, uh, have you seen snatch beyond yes i have yeah great film the yeah, righteous yeah. what is nemesis nemesis is the righteous infliction of retribution <laughs> I, I, I can't remember the whole saying but something I'm, like that yeah, yeah. <laughs> i'm gonna have to get you to read that in a minute beyond just to end the show okay but anyway <laughs> you'll move beyond you're oh okay hang on i'll get the board up i did actually i have a oh, okay so yeah, yeah. night c3 I have a friend who, who used to own a pub I used to uh, frequent, and we called him Bricktop because he just reminded everyone of Bricktop. All right. <laughs> Righteous. In, yeah, we're going to get you to read that out, Bjorn, to end the show, I feel. Okay. Bishop F4. Here we go. We're back into our... Back in, look, the Jabava, you know this. Basically, I think what we've gathered, Bjorn, is that the Jabava London is basically just winning. Is that right? It's just, it's just unbeatable, it's just, it's pretty just, much. It's yeah. just very good. Very good opening. Okay, so I'm gonna uh, I'll play. 
Yeah, why not? Keep it, keep it sensible. Yeah. Da, da, da. He he uh, he's already avoided the first trick, and now he's playing this. Okay. Yeah. Good thing it's your move. Okay, I'm gonna go here, and yep. when the, the kind of the rule is when they go bishop b4, you, you don't commit your knight here too quickly because there might be a better square to bring it to. Right. Okay. So saying that, I'll go knight g e2. Yeah, just so we can kick the bishop, try to win yeah. the dark squares, and just play sensible sensible moves here. Uh, okay, so yeah, the, the phrase you're going to have to say, I want you to say it in a second, Bjorn. Is it my move? Yep. Uh, yep. Okay, I might just castle here. I'll, I'll do it first, and we're going to see who says it's better, who says it's better okay? <laughs> so this famous quotes from the film Snatch, and um, I'll let Bjorn play his move while I say it, and it's... Uh, A3. A3, okay, good move. So I'm going to say it now. It is... The Nemesis, a righteous infliction of retribution manifested by an appropriate agent personified by a horrible person, me. Now, I won't, <laughs> I won't, I won't say the swear word because it's a pretty pretty harsh one. So we'll, we'll leave the swear word out of it. But okay, now over to you, Bjorn. You're going to have to say it. So it's, it's in the chat? Okay, let's see. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Chess Bay. I haven't seen you for ages, Chess Bay. So... I uh, hope, hope you're doing well, Chess Bay. So yeah, don't don't do it with the swearing because in the film he does swear and it's pretty serious swear word. So we we avoid the swear word. But uh, yes. Okay. Okay. I'll just find a move first. Yeah, you, uh, you find a move first. Okay. Uh, Queen of three. Queen of three. All right. Is, is Charlie still in the chat? I don't know if Charlie's here or is, is Charlie having a little nap? I'm subbing for Charlie. Thank you. Thank you, Chess Bay. Charlie was here earlier. I don't know. I don't know where Charlie's gone. Let's see. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna wake Charlie up. Uh, okay. All right. So that's a good move. Our opponent's playing well. He's putting our bishop on a bad square. So okay. So right. Come on. Come on, Bjorn. You're gonna have to okay. say the sentence now. Okay. Have you, have you got it up there? <laughs> and you've got to say it in the most nemesis. A righteous inflection. No, you've got to do it in an English accent. Try again. It's gonna be. Can you do it one more time so I can hear? Okay. It. Okay. Nemesis, a righteous infliction of retribution manifested by an appropriate agent personified by a horrible person, me. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you work for Simon. <laughs> this is this. <laughs> Nemesis, a righteous infliction of <laughs> retribution manifested by an appropriate agent personified in this case by a horrible person like me <laughs> a person like me yeah <laughs> that was the best i can do man i'm horrible at that <laughs> i have to say i found that very amusing <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why but i found that oh, really, good for you <laughs> i found it really <laughs> me yeah I, I mean just just oh. your I, I like a norwegian trying to do a london accent i think is is, yeah, is yeah. very funny man it's very funny Right. Yeah. Bishop takes the uh, uh, bishop takes f6. Looks good. Okay. Anyway, mm -hmm. well done, Bjorn. brave man. Thank you. Joining. So well done. <laughs> Round of applause to Bjorn. I think. Is it my move? My move here. Yeah, okay. yeah. All right. Let's, let's let's grab that one, shall we? Why not? Let's, let's, oh, I was let's... thinking queen takes. Oh yeah, we could have done that as well. I didn't. Why did I play that? That's a much better move. I, I'm still thinking about your accents there. Oh, it's your move. Bjorn. Bishop takes. Okay. Sorry, I gave that one away, but we should we should be playing it. You were pretty good there, Bjorn. You were. People are saying you're pretty good. You're you're a cockney at heart. People are really nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my move. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to move back because yeah. uh, well, I could have done Why something not? else, but could have taken yeah. b6 or something. But you know, maybe this is this is okay as well. We're threatening a couple of things. We're threatening a couple of things, indeed. It's hard to protect them. Mm. It is. I think I'll play knight c7. Juicy. A juicy fork there. Nice and juicy fork. I think we're going to keep 100% with the Chabava London, Bjorn. Yeah, it's, yeah, not, it's not us. It's the system. It's just yeah. unbeatable. It is. This is nothing to do, nothing to do with our play at, at all. It's actually hard to protect the rook or get even get the knight back. It is, actually. Is he going to lose the whole rook? I think so. Yeah, this looks really bad for my move. Well, I'm going to grab that one. And then I'm going to come back and grab the other one. <laughs> I'm going to grab them all. I'm going to be greedy. Yeah. Yeah. 
So we're six points up. We are six points up and up on time. Yeah, we're we're, we're we're cruising, man. We're cruising. We are cruising, 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 cruising. Smooth, smooth, smooth. Your move, Bjorn. Yeah, no, I'll just go knight c7 again. That knight, the Jabava knight, has that's, caused... That's a, been, yeah. It's done its little walk of doom. My move? Okay. Yep. Now. Well, I'm just going to take that one off. I had some other moves, but... Ooh. Yeah, but now d5. Ooh. Oh. It's kind of... It can't get much worse for black here. <laughs> there we go. Well yeah, done. Yeah, that was Bjorn. a bit unlucky. Everything kind of fell apart there. Yeah, everything fell apart. I mean, uh, let's have a look at the opening again. I mean, so he played, he played d5. He played a6 here. Now, one thing we could have played, and it's up to the positions you like. e3 is totally fine. Mm -hmm. The other way you can play this, if you like the positions, you have the opportunity to go e4. Because in the, in because it's kind of a French defense, but in the French defense, black doesn't. He does play a6, but he doesn't always play a6. So mm -hmm. it's kind of we're playing very strongly in the center. But e3 was also a good move. So we will... Uh, how do I get the game back? I don't know. This one. Aha. Uh -huh. No, we don't flip the board. Let's go back. So e3 was a good move as well. And if he ever goes c5 here, we're probably always taken on c5, unless he waits too long. And now we just did the plan that we saw before. Bishop d3, knight e2 with a nice position. If you ever play C5 now, I think we always take it. And this is quite an important position. I'm going to just give you one more test before you go, Bjorn. In this position, well, our next stage now, we don't need to go knight E2 because the bishop's not on B4. Mm -hmm. So stage one is to develop the knight and castle. And you should probably castle kingside this way. Mm -hmm. And once you have done that, let's say black castles, what's a very important move to play here? And this is, this is key in the positions where you take on c5 and anyone who's brought the course in the chat this can be a question for you because if you brought the course above you'll know the answer to this question what should white play in, in this position well i know there are some lines where you play knight a4 when you've taken uh, i'm trying to figure out if that makes sense there you you often play knight a4 but only when you have a pawn still on c5 so not in this position the scooter has it straight away uh -huh, okay yeah yeah so uh, right. And Iron Brick Top. Well, I think the Dutch is better Iron Brick Top, but it's up to you. So, what is the uh, what is the move beyond? Do you think? So normally I would think uh, a knight e5. Just the knight kind of belongs there, but it's okay. But it feels like you're looking. Okay, so um, no. there's a move here that's very important. It's like you're looking for some. Yeah. Tell me. Okay, well, the move, the move here that you should play after you have this exchange is e4. And uh -huh. the point of this move is if black doesn't take this pawn, let's say he plays knight c6, you can go here. Mm -hmm. And then let's say the knight goes there. It's a very strong move now. Oh, this looks like a great gift yeah. situation. Yeah, very you, nice one. Yeah. You, you can come here and this is, very, yeah. this is probably a winning attack. Yeah, and as soon as you get rid of that... Yeah. Knight on f6 is always very dangerous. And if black does take here, okay, the queens can come off, which some people don't like, but okay, it doesn't mm -hmm. matter. I don't know which rook I take with, but white is quite a lot better, right. funnily yeah. enough, because this bishop is horrible, trapped in behind mm. these pawns. And all our pieces are very nicely developed. We have a queenside majority of pawns here, which can later become a passed pawn. So it's just a little bit better for white, this position. Yep. So it's worth remembering that one. Right, well, Bjorn, I'll let you go because it looks like yep. you're, you're in you're in need there, and, and we'll catch up um, tomorrow or Monday um, about you know Ginger GM stuff, yeah. So cool, and uh, everyone say goodbye to Bjorn, and I'll let Bjorn say goodbye to everyone, yeah. So goodbye, everyone. Thanks for the for the stream. Hope you enjoyed, and see you soon again. Thanks, Bjorn. Great, great, great to see you. And I'll catch up with you soon, Bjorn. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. We'll talk tomorrow. Yeah. All right. Definitely. Cheers, mate. Bye. Bye. See you. Okay. So uh, lo lovely to have Bjorn on and just try and something a bit different. I mean, we, we always do some sort of lesson with Bjorn. This one's a bit more chilled out than uh, some of the other lessons that uh, I've done with Bjorn. And we're really concentrating today on just both us playing Jabava London, having a quick look at some ideas after it to give, to hopefully give you guys a better idea. Uh, about what the opening is about and 
the Jabava London is where you play these three moves and then you sort of decide on, on how to proceed. So hopefully some of you have understood it a little bit better there. Um, there is a, a short, there is a free one hour course you can watch as well. Um, I don't know where the link is. I think it's something like exclamation free. Is this going to work? There you go. So if you follow the link there, that's free and it's an hour course I've done on the opening. So you don't have to pay anything. You get it free as well. So I'm going to call it a day today, guys, and it, I will be back tomorrow streaming at the same time. It's going to be a bit more chilled out and, you know, relaxing tomorrow um, as I, uh, me and Bjorn, uh, well, me, we're not doing a lesson, but me and Blair are just going to, you know, do something a bit random. So hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. And uh, like I say, I'm streaming all the way up to Halloween, just, you know, a bit. Maybe I'll try to do a longer stream over the weekend. So Thank you very much and uh, thank you for joining in. Okay, not a very long stream, but still about an hour and a half and I'll get back into it and I'll see you all soon. So have a good, uh, good Thursday. Goodbye. <clears throat>